Hello everyone and welcome to the Vortex, where lies and falsehoods are trapped and exposed. I'm Michael Vorce. Sometimes we Catholics can get a little myopic in our vision. For example, we tend to think of Jesus existing just as of 2,000 years ago. Now in one sense, the theological sense, of course that's right. The second person of the Holy Trinity took on flesh 2,000 years ago and His name is Jesus. But the second person of the Holy Trinity did exist before He joined human nature to Himself. He even says to the Jews at one point, as recorded in John's Gospel, Truly, truly, I tell you, before Abraham came to be, I am. And even before Abraham, even back to Noah, and of course, even before then. Jesus even tells us in Luke's Gospel, I saw Satan fall like lightning from the sky. So, what's the point? Well, we mentioned Noah for a reason. Jesus says, in those days before the flood, they were eating and drinking, marrying and giving in marriage up to the day that Noah entered the ark. And of course, we all know what happened after that. The flood came, and that was all she wrote for the rest of society. And Jesus, in his divinity, was an eyewitness to that. Does anyone who is really a faithful Catholic really think that things are going to continue as they are indefinitely? I don't mean the end of the world. I mean the end of this current world, the culture. How long do any of us think that God will simply allow the current state of affairs to continue? Millions upon millions of surgical abortions. Sex being debased so, for so long now that it's become an acceptable industry. Families destroyed, usually over sex, but not always. Children left fatherless, and on and on. Almighty God can address any situation any way He sees fit. Sometimes, as in the days of Noah, He intervenes directly and decidedly. Other times, He allows nature, the natural consequences of things, to simply take their course. If a society elevates pleasure and self-centeredness to the level of a God, then that society will ultimately fall apart. That's a law of the universe. When cultures diminish themselves by killing off large portions of the next generation, economies begin to stagnate. When political leaders turn their thoughts to themselves at the expense of the governed, the establishment begins to break down. The only guarantee to prevent this sort of thing is good moral order, and a good moral order is only guaranteed by following Christ. Following Christ is most perfectly assured through the teachings of the Catholic Church, which he founded for this very purpose. When society lives for its own pleasure and ignores God, it will be washed away, sometimes directly by God, other times by the laws of nature that God established. He directly intervened in the case of Noah. He allowed the forces of nature to intervene when the Romans destroyed Jerusalem and butchered the inhabitants. He cried over Jerusalem, knowing that its fate would be horrendous, because, as he said, For the days are coming upon you when your enemies will raise a palisade against you. They will encircle you and hem you in on all sides. They will smash you to the ground and your children within you, and they will not leave one stone upon another within you, because you did not recognize the time of your visitation. Whether God intervenes directly or allows circumstances and consequences to follow to their natural end, the end is the same. This is one of our driving concerns here at RealCatholicTV.com. We don't care about getting rich or making a name for ourselves or being contrarian or even developing the coolest internet presence in the history of the human race. We, like many others, see a culture committing suicide and too many in the church remaining quiet about it. Remember, Jesus was an eyewitness to all of human history. What he said back then is just as true now, and his church needs to be sounding the clarion call and sounding it loudly. God bless you. I'm Michael Voris. Please help us keep delivering these kinds of messages that so desperately need to be heard and acted on. Join RealCatholicTV.com today as a premium subscriber. Become immersed in the faith established by Jesus Christ. The Catholic Church is the only hope against evil because that is its God-given mission. As our Lord said, apart from me, you can do nothing. Join RealCatholicTV.com today as a premium subscriber and come to learn and love Christ more deeply.